hip and knee osteoarthritis part one, introduction to videos and osteoarthritis. The information provided about hip and knee osteoarthritis in these videos is for general physiotherapy advice only. The content is intended for information purposes only and is not meant as a substitute for professional advice, diagnosis or treatment. So my name's Owen, I'm a physiotherapist at Nottingham City Care. I'll be taking you through these videos. So the aim of these videos is to increase your understanding of hip and knee osteoarthritis, to provide you with skills to manage your symptoms, to help you to carry out your normal activities without fear of pain, and to set goals that will motivate you to continue to exercise. There are four parts to these videos. You might want to grab a pen and paper now to write down any questions you may have for your physiotherapist following watching these videos. So what is osteoarthritis? Osteoarthritis, or commonly known as OA, is a common condition that causes joints to become painful and stiff and is typically seen in adults of over 45 years. The main features of OA include cartilage thinning. Cartilage thinning occurs where the lining of the bone ends becomes thinner and rougher. This causes the joint to repair itself by remodeling bone at the joint edges. These are known as osteophytes or bony spurs. So this process is known as wear and repair. So you're getting wearing of the cartilage and then repairing in the form of bony spurs or osteophytes. Muscle weakness around the joint also occurs. You also get thickening of the ligaments and joint capsule leading to the stiffening of the joint. Local inflammation can also occur. So here are some important facts about osteoarthritis. Fact number one, a diagnosis of osteoarthritis does not necessarily mean a continued deterioration in the joint. This means that if you have a diagnosis of osteoarthritis, it doesn't necessarily mean that your condition is going to get worse over time. Fact number two, Changes on an x-ray do not correlate with the pain that a person may experience. And this highlights that other factors play an important role. And we will discuss this more in part three of the videos. Fact number three, there is no cure, but the research has shown that remaining active can make a significant difference. We will now discuss this a little bit more in part number two of the videos.